good evening. This is Abraham, and welcome to class three on the series on the action script calculator. On the previous tutorials, we created the number buttons. Uh, one single button with the nice effect was created and then duplicated ten times, one for each digit, starting at one, finishing at zero after nine. And today we want to do the same thing for the operators. The idea is to create a calculator from scratch. No small detail is missed, no small move is left behind. You want every dot, every single line to be in place, every single uh, action to be recorded. All right, time to create our operators. Operators are the minus, the plus, divide, the multiply, the dot, the equal, the clear signs that every calculator has. And we want them to be similar but not identical to the numbers. And for that, the process is, as you guys know, same. You're going to create a number, a button with a very nice s effect and uh, soon we'll be duplicating it one by one. Now you guys know that each button has three states, up state, down, and hit. And each one of them has a keyframe. And we want to make sure that our users, they get the same label when they have the mouse over. Yes, we don't want a different label there. So therefore we have to go one by one and change the keyframe on the state. And uh, for that we wisely placed uh, two different layers. One layer with the underlying effect, the mouse over the hit, and one uh, upper layer with the label itself. So when we change the keyframe, like we're doing now, does not affect the underlying effect. So currently SayWeb has over 5,000 and growing unique visitors every month, and uh, they come and watch the tutorials, they come to see the documented code, yes, we post the code for free, all the source code for all tutorials we post on the website, and is extensively documented, easy to understand, easy to copy, so people who want to improve themselves, people who want to learn, people who want to go ahead, they come, they visit, they welcome to drop by, we have sponsors, that's how we support the site, so everything you see, for those who want to come, it's free, it's available, please come, please visit. We are finishing with our operators, again we have three different keyframes, each one of them has a label on different layers. The, layers with the, the layer with the effect is locked, the layer with the label is being changed one by one, the up state, the down state, the hit state, and we make sure that we have uh, the same label on each one of the keyframes. And if you guys ask me what is the need for one more calculator, there's plenty of calculators out there. Well, I have a few answers for that. The first one is that it's a great starting point for those who want to create applications. If you're able to finish, if you're able to accomplish your own calculator, new challenges will arise and you'll be able to face them. Yes, it builds self-confidence. Uh, that's the first, ex first explanation. The second one is uh, there's never too much. I mean, there's two ways of looking at it. So many people doing calculators. Why do you need another one? I could say if there are so many people out there doing calculators, perhaps there is room for one more. It's always good to belong to a crowd. So calculator is our project. Uh, we've been posting. Yes, we have been posting our final results on Widgetbox, one of top 1,000 sites that's been visited on the planet and they've been reviewing our gadgets, they've been posting them. The clock has been downloaded, the clock has been reviewed, approved and has been downloaded to social networks, to Facebook. And just to prove my point, this calculator won't be any different. We plan to finish, we plan to present and will be reviewed and will be approved. And I'll move on. And I'm glad to, uh, my dear listener, to participate with that, so I can open the path for you. 
our mission is to teach our mission is to demonstrate our mission is to elevate welcome to join all right enough of pep talk that you turned on another reason my tutorials are sometimes long because allows me to speak a bit more it helps me too all right, we have the grid, so we align the buttons one below the other, one next to the other. We want to have a neat pad, so another technique is just ask for a line, and let's put left over here, and we have the buttons one exactly to the other, one exactly on top of the other, and we need one more, the clear sign, and... Uh, I guarantee you, my dear listener, that you'll be amazed how simple it is once the design is ready to put on some code. It's only a few lines. We are deep. I'll explain one by one, but you will see how, how simple it is to create a calculator. And then, as I told you guys before, you'll be able to move on. You'll be able to create your own stuff. Welcome to join. Welcome to participate. Let's see what's going on. Uh, same thing, we have to have the same label, each one of the keyframes. We have to have the uh, last button aligned in stage. And uh, this is it. This is it. All right, one more alignment to go. And uh, everything you see here you can access from the website. The source code is available there. Welcome to visit. Welcome to subscribe. Yes, we have over 30 subscribers right now. And they get a, on the email. They get an email, RSS, real simple. And uh, whenever you post a new tutorial, they see, they come. And uh, you're welcome. It's free also. All paid by sponsors. We're not charging a dime. We, yes, it's free. Let Google pay for your learning. And one more alignment to go. You want to have a little bit neat. Uh, we also have to do the equal sign. Uh, actually, out of place, we have a, a, a square here, a rectangle. Eventually, I'll find a better place for the equal sign. Uh, but for the meanwhile, just put there on that corner until we f have a better place for it. Uh, the important thing here is get done with the uh, our calculator so we can move on to the code itself um, this is pretty much it uh, let's move this C out of there it's an equal sign and let's move on each one of the keyframes again copy frame paste frame copy frame paste frame so we have all states with identical label all right, you guys, again, thank you very much for watching my tutorial, and I hope you join in. I hope you come back for the next lesson. Uh, my email shows at the screen if you have suggestions, if you have questions, if you have remarks, be in touch. Thank you very much.